anything you want to say about a uh, limited run? Yeah, limited run had a, a really good showing this year. Um, I pay attention to what they put out and I try to grab stuff. I've got a lot more interested in what they're um, doing with the, now that they're putting out switch releases. I have some of their PS4 stuff and some of their Vita stuff. Um, but the switch stuff has definitely caught my attention and they've got just some great stuff on the way. Um, golf story is one that I'm looking forward to very much. Um, yes. No, nothing. Oh, I was going to uh, shush Who's... some people away from my window. Oh, <laughs> or outside. Okay. Go on. Um, I wanted to play golf story very much. Uh, and I just had a feeling when they announced that they were going to be releasing switch games, that this one would be one of them. This will be my first limited run purchase. This will Your be first. Yeah. Wow. I, I, I was thinking about getting night trap too. I was thinking about night trap on switch. I have it already for the PlayStation 4. I don't know if I need it a second time. <laughs> um, but I think it's, you know, but, it's great that it's coming. But to Golf Switch. Story has the aesthetic for Switch as perfect. It, it, it's, it's, yeah. Because it's become like the de facto sort of retro look game system, especially for any titles. So Golf Story um, is one that I wanted to play anyway at some point. So I might as well just wait for the, the limited run. Yeah. And, and that's that's how nice. I was too. I just, I, I felt like it was definitely... Um, it was definitely going to head to this uh, for physical when they um, when they announced that. So I felt like I'd wait for that. So can you pre-order that Golf Story one yet or no? I don't know, actually. I'm trying to see. Can you pre-order the Switch version of, uh, of uh, Night Trap yet? Mm, look. I'm looking. I'm looking, damn it. Look. I, so what's been sold out here uh, recently? A lot of stuff. So... Uh, yeah, so I, I think uh, what I took away from just all of this is that I did not realize they've really ramped up in only uh, two and a half years how much, how many games are coming out. <laughs> oh yeah, no, I mean it's insane. So I follow them on Twitter, and yeah, I mean they, they, have, they have multiple releases. I mean multiple. They multiple almost releases have releases every al month. Almost one a week. Um, I think they're up to like a hundred and sixty something total. In, terms in, in of two every, and a half years, and everything. And, done. and it used to be like one a month. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. So. The golf story is big. The ukulele is big. I love Thumper. I have Thumper on two systems, though, so I don't know if I'll, you know, go for that. Um, on PlayStation uh, and Vita, there's two big ones. Um, Spelunky is getting a physical release. That's I, interesting. I've bought Spelunky, I don't know, three, four times. I'll definitely buy a physical copy of that. It's one of my favorite games, period. And um, Senran Kagura, Bon Appetit is uh coming out physically on vita and um it's the only center and kagura game that's been released in the u.s that doesn't have a physical copy yet so i'll definitely get that for my collection which game center and kagura bon appetit i'm not familiar uh boobs ninjas cooking boobs it's part of the boobs ninja cooking genre of, of it's the... part of the boobs ninjas genre this is the cooking ver uh, are, the, the, are cooking the boobs game. on the food or on the on the ninjas on the ninjas so you play as a boob ninja you play as a boob ninja while cooking. While cooking? Yeah. It's a rhythm okay. It's a rhythm cooking game. Okay. Yep. So there do, it is. do the boobs go in rhythm? They sort of bounce around in rhythm. I, they, I mean, I don't know. I, actually, <laughs> I mean, you have to pay attention to the beats, but I'm assuming they... I mean, they do. There's lots of bouncing in the Center and Kagura series. Did I miss out on, on the, the, the Night Trap pre-order for the Switch? Was that the same time as the PS4? I thought it wasn't. No, it wasn't. It was? Okay, I just want to make sure. They probably just haven't done it yet. Okay. So, okay. Anyways, yeah, lots of good stuff coming out from them. Stuff, uh, more things that I missed, I'm sure. But so they're gonna. The, the, the good news about this is with limited run. But besides, the good news that you know they're, they're making physical media for these games that wouldn't normally have it is that now you're gonna have it for all these Switch games you wouldn't normally have, and it gives you more options for Switch, obviously, which I like because I'm more apt to get a game physically because I'm an old fart versus not. So, like I said, Golf Story, I'm I'm all in on the Golf Story. I'm all in. So that you it. can get the physical game and then turn your system on and then fall asleep. No, I, I, I fell asleep before I downloaded Fortnite on Switch, Ian. <laughs> I don't want my first experience to be Sleepy Pat because I have normal sleep hours, unlike you. So when it gets to 11 o'clock at night, I get sleepy sometimes. I'm sorry. And I can't <laughs> stay up. I got to get up early at Castle Country. I got to plan a podcast. I got to, you know, answer emails from an app who doesn't pay me for my app, you know. So it doesn't seem like you've been paying that much attention. You can also, um, as far as I know, with all the games now, 
um, you get like a two week open pre order, so you don't have to wake up at like six on a Friday to try to get one of the games. An open pre order. I mean, for one of these, it's a yeah. rolling pre order. Yeah. So, so that means it won't be limited to like a certain amount. Uh, the right. collector's editions are, but oh, but you not know, the regular. But one. if you if you just want a physical copy of the game, um, at least in my recent experience, it's just been you know they announce it and then for the regular th- edition you get two weeks. I think that's the way to go. I think it's the way you, if you have two different editions, because then it, it allows more to be made of the regular one. And you don't piss off the potential scalping crowd for like the for like the collector's limited one. You know, every, everyone wins in theory. But for a golf story, I might I might want the collector's edition based upon something. I might want the collector's edition. So, all right. Uh, so, Josh and Doug keeping it going strong on the mid-run. Why wouldn't they? They don't ever sleep. Okay. 